Subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified about the highlights of India's smartest podcast, The Ranveer Show. This is TRS Clips. Everyone has a biological clock, but for women, people talk about it a lot more. That you won't be able to have babies after a certain point. Yeah, sure. I feel like even guys have some sort of a biological clock. Yeah, in I'm terms sure. of I'm you sure crave you fatherhood, you crave stability. Yeah, and uh, for sure. I don't have time for a personal life, but I think about fatherhood a lot as a concept. That's what I want to ask you. Yeah, what's fatherhood like? And and why should a man crave it versus when when do you know you're ready for it? So I think firstly it's very personal, and uh, I think marriage and uh, being a parent are two things you can never truly be prepared for, uh, because you can't know how to deal with something till you do it. Mm. You know, um, it's like the difference between concepts and reality, theory and uh, you know practical experience. You can tell somebody how to drive a car all you want. in you know, every possible detail but somebody who's driven it still knows how to do it even though they might not be able to express how they do it mm-hmm. and that's kind of what parenting is like once you get there you figure it out how how do you feel when you're holding your baby in your arms best person? feeling in the world man best feeling in the world Just nothing like it ever like you nothing, can't give a reference point nothing and it doesn't come back also no because they keep growing <laughs> so you know you miss the the one month version then you miss the six month version then you miss the one year version and you know it just keeps going it's like they just keep growing bigger and you feel like you know that that little guy is gone that little <laughs> chotu misha is gone that little chotu zenu is gone and now you know they're growing up so fast so you know it it just your parents tell you all the time you know that you know कब बड़े हो गए पता ही नहीं चला एंड यू फील लाइक हाँ वट एवर एंड वेन इट हैपन्स टू यू एज अ पेरेंट यू लाइक मैन आई नो एक्जैक्टली वॉट दे टॉकिंग अबाउट यू नो दे से दैट इवन आवर पेरेंट्स लाइक हु आर प्रॉब्लम सिक्सटी नाउ सेवेंटी नाउ दे आल्सो स्टिल ग्रोइंग अप एंड वी नीड टू कीप दैट मैन नो दे आर नाउ ग्रोइंग डाउन यू नो इट्स लाइक यू गो फ्रॉम बींग अ चाइल्ड टू एन अडल्ट एंड देन यू स्टार्ट बिकमिंग अ चाइल्ड अगेन सो आई रियली फील दैट्स ट्रू यू नो दे बिकम आई डोट नो इफ इट्स गेटिंग क्लोजर टू गॉड और इट इज जस्ट आई डोट नो वॉट इट इज बट इट्स जस्ट दैट यू नो The way I look at it, I think your senses get withdrawn from the world, like your eyesight, your ears. All all the senses go inwards towards what's inside you. Probably, which is which is God. Yeah, uh, I guess. Do you feel you're growing up in the process of having kids? Like, how are you growing as a person now? I was kind of ready for it, I think, for a while. Because when it happened, it felt very smooth for me. Like I, um, I think a part of me was craving and waiting for it, and so I just, it was like. I was like a fish in water. Why were you craving for it? I don't know. I think I was just wanting a normal family life, and I mm. wanted, uh, you know, I wanted my unit, mm. and I wanted, uh, uh, you know, that feeling of a complete home. Mm. Uh, you know, that's the best feeling in the world. And I was living on my own for a very long period of time, oh. and I many times had nobody to share my happiness and my sorrow with. In fact, I told my wife this. You know, I told Mira. I said that you know I I won every possible award for Heather that year, and I specifically remember one time because you know these awards happened at BKC, uh, you know, and I was driving back and it's a long drive back and it was late at night, and you know my award was lying on the next seat next to me and I was sitting in the rear passenger seat, and I was like, but like who do I share this with? Like mm. who do I share? Truly share how I'm feeling with? Yeah, you can talk to your mom, you can talk to your dad, but to have somebody you share life with who's you know. your partner in life i was that was the first day i was like i think i'm done with this phase like mm. i think i want to share now mm. this individual phase of my life of of being all about myself uh in whatever way i mean i think i you know we go through that phase where you are at the top of your own mind and you need to discover yourself and you need to find yourself i was like yeah i i i need somebody to share now mm. you know i was ready for it Yeah, I think these questions are coming from the same place. Man. I'm feeling <laughs> the same sharing emotion at this yes. stage, which is why I have more questions. It's the me. difference between pleasure and happiness. You know, they say pleasure is a very personal emotion. It's like dopamine, and they say happiness is an emotion that can only be shared. It's like serotonin. Mm. So you know, mm. yeah. and and joy is the emotion that is actually there even after the happiness goes Absolutely. away. Absolutely, absolutely. 